Hey everybody, Ken Surfs here, and as you can tell, we are not in the shave den. This is going to be another travel shave. I'm in Las Vegas. It's a pleasant like 43 degrees out here, and uh, we came away for a couple of days, you know, brought my wife out here, and they have like an enchanted village Christmas themed light show going on in the uh in the uh, casino or in the uh, hotel complex, so we'll be taking her to see that tonight. And uh, I'm in need of a shave, and since I didn't fly, I got to bring my Gillette Aristocrat today. So we're going to use a vintage Gillette razor today. I've got uh, Truffet and Hill, or Truffet and Hill, however you want to pronounce it, unscented. I'll be using the soap today. I've got my Omega Boar. Or Samog, sorry, Samog Boar. In fact, I better be soaking that here. We don't have a crystal skull, but we do have that. So I'll put that in there to soak. And uh, Truffet and Hill, is it old Spanish? Spanish leather cologne, we'll be doing that uh, after. And it is freezing out there. I mean, I'm not used to these cold temperatures. I left Newcastle, England a long time ago, so, you know, <laughs> I left the, the cold weather behind there. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty chilly out there today. All right, so I am in need of a quick shave, so we'll be doing that, and uh, welcome. All right. Yeah, the acoustics in here are terrible, so, you know. I work with what I'm dealt here. <laughs> All right. Truff it and hit. True truff it and hill. There we go. Oh yeah. Yeah, and unscented. It's not gonna take away from the cologne. Hope this camera stays on the mirror. If it doesn't, we're gonna have some trouble. I hope we can catch it before it goes into the sink. It's just my luck, right? Yeah, it's uh, Wednesday today. We arrived here yesterday. Uh, got to got to <laughs> got to do some gambling. I got to stay on the roulette table for probably thirty minutes, and I think it was five or ten dollars minimum bet a roll. So and then I left with thirty bucks. So yeah, I was well entertained. I didn't come out rich. Came out with thirty bucks, but for about an hour or so, or almost an hour, I got to play. So it was quite nice. All right. And inside the vintage Gillette Aristocrat, I have a Wilkinson Sword Gillette blade. There we go. All right, let's get the shave started. You guys having a good week? I began my vacation. So I am officially on vacation now until the 2nd of January. And I'm not really going anywhere. Uh, sticking around the house, this is just a getaway. But for $65 a night at the Conrad, at the Hilton Resort, Resort Worlds, Las Vegas, you can't go wrong with these midweek deals. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, so last night I took a trip down memory lane. In this casino, they have, uh, let's just say I was playing the horses. Here's the point. My dad used to play that, and I actually played that for about an hour and a half, and it was a $5 minimum bet a roll, and an hour and a half later, I walked away with nothing, but it was pretty fun. My dad used to play them all the time when the Imperial Palace used to be here in Las Vegas. He used to crack up, he'd go, come on, number three, come on! You know, mechanical horses, still bigger. Then, you know, there's a lot of stuff to do in Vegas that people don't really take advantage of. Uh, about half hour drive outside of the city is Red Rock Canyon, and that was pretty, pretty nice. It was 37 degrees there, but uh, here's a few scenes of what that looked like. Right. 
Yeah, it was pretty nice. Nice loop. I think it's like a 16 mile loop. And uh, in the old days, I kind of hiked down to the bottom, but uh, I was wearing my Nikes and I didn't want to, <laughs> my wife was wearing boots, cowboy boots. So yeah, we didn't want to do any hiking. We just stayed on the loop and kind of looked around. But uh, that was a lot of fun. And I got to go here. In fact, I'm gonna do a whole video on this one. The Pinball Hall of Fame in Las Vegas on the Strip across from the Mandalay Bay. Here's kind of a quick look. So I'm gonna do a whole video on that because they have the new James Bond game there, the Pro Edition. I got the premium on order, uh, but uh, I got a chance to play a few games on the James Bond machine. So that was pretty good. They had two, two of them. And then my wife kicked my ass on air hockey, seven to two. Uh, but like I said, there's a lot more to do in Vegas than gamble. Those slot machines will eat your money in 10 seconds. And then what do you do? <laughs> All right. Oh, they also have a, a free display at the Bellagio. It's all decked out for Christmas. Again, you can fast forward through these if you want to, but I'm just kind of showing you what's out there. But this is the Bellagio. took my wife there and that's all it took. She loves that place. So, uh, I'm in her good graces now, I think. And I took her to her favorite vegan restaurant. So, and I'm not vegan, but she is, but doesn't hurt to eat healthy once in a while. I had a club sandwich. It tastes just like chicken to me. Must've been tofu. All right, now let's dry off here. Okay. Ah, the only bummer with this, it's not a shake, it's a, it's a spray, but let's see here. Yeah, there's a burn. No, oh, there's a good burn. Whew. Well, I'm probably not gonna get this video up today or tomorrow, maybe tomorrow. We'll see how, how quickly I can edit it, but uh, tonight I'm gonna be pretty busy, so I know I'm not gonna be doing it tonight. So, I look forward to seeing you in the next video, and you're gonna see a Pinball Hall of Fame uh, review coming up, and it's not gonna be a shaving video. If you're interested, tune in. If not, you can wait till the next one. All right, everybody, thank you very much for watching, and uh, greetings from cold Las Vegas. We'll see you soon.